Hey everybody, today I'm diving into a fascinating corner of Japan's car culture VIP cars, the luxury rides favoured by the Japanese Mafia, also known as the Yakuza. If you're a car enthusiast, you're in for a treat. Let's roll. First off, what exactly is a VIP car? VIP stands for Very Important Person, and these cars are all about luxury, comfort and an imposing presence. Picture sleek black sedans with tinted windows, chrome accents and plush interiors. Now let's get into the specifics. Toyota has some real gems in the VIP lineup. The Toyota Century, often dubbed as Japan's Rolls-Royce, is a classic example. It's got a V8 engine, hand-assembled interior and even wool seats. Not to mention its iconic Phoenix hood ornament. This car screams sophistication and power, making it a top pick for the Yakuza. Next up, the Lexus LS series. The LS400 and LS460 are particularly popular. These cars are known for their silent cabins, advanced tech and buttery smooth ride. The interior, think leather seats, wood trims and state-of-the-art infotainment systems, perfect for showing off wealth and status. Nissan's entry into the VIP arena is the President. This model, especially the H252, is a staple in the Yakuza fleet. It's got a long wheelbase, luxurious leather and wood interior, plus a powerful V8 engine. It's designed for those who want to make a statement without saying a word. Speaking of making statements, Infinity offers the Q45. This car was designed with a focus on comfort and performance, featuring a powerful V8 and a lush interior with all the bells and whistles. It's a real head-turner, exuding quiet confidence. Mazda's contribution to the VIP world is the Sentia. While it might not be as flashy as a Lexus or Nissan, it's still a favourite, especially the second generation. Its interior is all about understated elegance with comfortable seating and ample legroom, perfect for a smooth, discreet ride. Finally, let's talk about Subaru. The Subaru Legacy B4, not your typical VIP car, yet it's found its niche. It's got a sporty edge but doesn't skimp on luxury. Leather seats, a powerful engine and a refined driving experience make it a surprising but solid choice. So why do the Yakuza favour these cars? It's all about blending in while standing out. These cars offer a perfect mix of luxury, power and anonymity. They're not just vehicles, they're status symbols. And there you have it, a glimpse into the world of Japan's VIP cars, the rides of choice for the country's elite and infamous. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Japanese car culture, hit that like button, subscribe, and let me know in the comments which VIP car is your favorite. Catch you in the next video. Stay curious, stay passionate, and keep driving those dreams.